Welcome back to the Gold Spartan. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to use a Sigma metallytic uh, analyzer to determine if uh, gold and silver uh, is real um, and, and basically just kind of how to use it. Uh, just got this machine in um, and uh, I think it's pretty cool. Uh, and so I thought there might be a few of you who, uh, you know, might want to see it in action, see how it works. So once you turn it on, um, it wants you to run a calibration, so you just click the Run Cal button. And as you can see, it has different settings. So for gold, I can search for 0.999 pure gold. Um, I can search for 91.7%, 90%, an American Eagle, Krugerrand, 98.6, Britannia. Um, so it'll actually, you can choose a specific setting uh, for that. Um, and that's important because like, give you an example, so we have a uh, uh, American Gold Eagle. And so if I put this on here, it will, actually I'm sorry. So you gotta click Run Cal. Then it says Place Sample, so you put the sample on there. And the way that you can tell that it's not matching up right is with this arrow on the right. It's showing you that this is not pure gold, which is good because American Gold Eagles are 22 karat gold. Um, so it's showing you that it does match that correctly. Now, if I go over to American Eagle and do Run Cal, you can see that, that black bar in the middle of the brackets says that that's in the range of where it should be, right? It's right in the middle. So you know that that one's good. Um, but compare that to the, uh, to the Buffalo, which is 24 karat gold. If I put that on this one, it's gonna show you that it's not uh, an American Eagle. And if we go back to pure gold and run, again, fits right where it should be. Um, now, I actually got a, uh, a fake silver panda, um, and I want to show you kind of what this looks like um, compared to a two ounce uh, Dragon Queen's Beast. So um, first we need to select the gold or the, uh, the metal. So we're going to select silver, and we're going to say ready. We put this down, and you can see it has that arrow showing all the way to the right, um, saying that this is not 99.99% silver, that it is uh, definitely something else. If I put in a different coin, right, perfect, right in the middle, showing you that it is pure silver. Um, and I think that, I think that's pretty cool. Uh, obviously, since I deal with a lot of gold and silver, it's pretty important to be able to check that information. Um, now, a couple other things that this has is you have these wands, and these are going to be for um, smaller metals. Um, as an example, sometimes something like, like this can be a little bit more difficult to pick up on this machine because you have the plastic, right? And you have, um, it's very thin metal. And so this only searches a certain thickness and if it doesn't fall within that range, it's not gonna give you accurate readings. Um, but if we come over here and we plug in this wand, say run. Now we can put this on there and the the metal has to, uh, I'm trying to do this, I'm not looking, it has to fit the entire um, uh, entire sensor on the metal and you can see it is showing in this situation, part of this is because I'm having trouble holding this and showing you at the same time. Um, it's showing just off, right outside the brackets, which just says that 
um, that you should, you know, test it and make sure, uh, again, um, when I normally do this without videoing it, it works perfectly. So of course that happens on here, but, um, but the main difference is that you can see it is not showing you all the way to the right. Um, you know, it's actually right near the bracket showing you that it is close. Um, and, the, and the main reason this is happening is just because, there we go, is that I'm uh, trying to film and do this at the same time. So you can see showing you right, right in the bracket. Um, so sometimes, you know, you gotta test a little bit uh, with some of the smaller pieces. Um, take something like a, a gold queen's beast that's not showing there um, I'm gonna I think that I think the uh, plastic on here is too thick for that but again you can see that it is pure gold so anyway that um, is how this works um, analyzes the metal and, and kind of tells you what uh, tells you if it is within the ranges that it needs to be uh, hopefully you learned something there um, I thought that it was very interesting and um, if you haven't uh, subscribed to my channel, do that. Click the bell icon so you're notified when I post. Make sure to check me out on Instagram, uh, the Gold Spartan 23, and check out my website, uh, www.thegoldspartan.com. Thank you all.